what is going on everybody y'all just clicked on another fully sponsored squirrel hunting video and i'm guessing from the thumbnail y'all knew that now what that means is if we pin squirrels to the feeder we're going to leave that in there and i'm sure we will because we've altered the feeder if there's a little bit of blood well i've hunted my whole life and i hadn't figured out how to do it where there's not blood yet so what we're going to be hunting with today is the 120 pound mini striker i got a stock on it and we're going to pair that up with my 12 inch hunting bolt it's got three inch veins it weighs about 150 grains and i just got a little old cheap 45 grain two blade broadhead on there now i broke out the chronograph and i ran that 12 inch bolt with that broadhead it's about 200 grain package not quite through all three of the bows and the 120 pound forward limb bow was shooting at somewhere around 215 feet per second the forward limb 150 pound bow i think was shooting at around 240 245 and then the reverse draw mini striker was shooting about 260 feet per second so i thought it was going to shoot a little faster than that but i double checked my weights with my little grain scale and we're that's just what it is that's what it shot so now let me get over here and show y'all this feeder we have altered it just a little bit for those of you that have watched the channel, you're probably thinking that's the same old feeder you always use. It's all shot up. It is the same feeder, but I have altered it. What I did was I took a saw and I cut the perch off of it. And then I put a board up so that the sunflower seeds couldn't fall out. And the idea is to get the squirrels hanging upside down. I have noticed uh, from hunting these squirrels over the last couple of years with a pistol crossbow that if they're hanging upside down, they can't get out of the way of the arrow. And these little boogers are fast. If they're not upside down, sometimes they do get out of the way of the arrow. I'm telling you, some of them are ninjas. If any of y'all noticed the war paint on the feeder, spoiler alert, I've already been out here this morning and I may have shot one or two squirrels already. But I still got the rest of the afternoon, so I'm going to crawl back off into the blind and try to shoot one or two more. Oh, they ain't going nowhere when they're hanging upside down. Oh, that's why we cut the uh, perch off the feeder. That is the money shot. Oh, I'm going to get this one cleaned, and then I'm going to go get me some lunch. I have actually been out here for longer than I expected. It took me a couple hours before a squirrel came. I've been sitting in that blind for a couple hours. broadhead it slips right out well almost slips out all right let me go get this squirrel clean and get me some lunch and we'll slip back out here for the afternoon He wouldn't hold still long enough hanging upside down. <laughs> but he didn't go nowhere. Yuck. How about that one? Oh, I didn't for sure wasn't going nowhere. Went through his head and his leg. Oh gosh. Well, another one for the pot. And they all count this time of year when season's getting close to being over. Oh man. I can't get that broadhead out of there. I'm gonna have to go get another arrow. 
I don't want to. I don't want to break this one. You get to wobbling on them, and you could break them. But we'll get me another arrow and an old one, and screw back into that broadhead and pull it out of that tree. Those little broadheads are wicked. Here we go. Old arrow. I'm not so much worried about breaking this one. Let's see if I can get this broadhead out in one piece. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah. Grab my squirrel. Go crawl off in the blind and see if we can shoot another one. I don't have to clean this one right away. It's cool enough today the thing set for a little while. Got that one right in the head. He ain't going nowhere. I don't know which is better. If they're hanging or if they're sitting there with their feet up facing right at you. I just do not know. They're both very ethical shots. Oh, goodness. Well, it's getting late in the day and I know my wife has dinner cooked. So I am going to get this squirrel cleaned and that will conclude our festivities for this video i tell y'all what the first person that orders a batch of 12 inch bolts after i drop this video i'll clean these up these two that i used to make the video and throw them in the package for you they're going to be used they may be a little bloody but uh they'll make you some target arrows so hey i appreciate y'all watching uh, that's all i got for today we'll catch you next time